All right, so for this part of the raglan increase, we are on the wrong side. So we're on the pearl side of a raglan increase and we are doing a make a wide make one right, make one left. But I just wanted to show you what that looks like on the pearl side of things. So we're gonna purl up to one stitch before our, make, our raglan increase like we did on our knit side. And then I'm gonna show you what you need to do, what that looks like. So it's weird doing it in video. All right, so now that we are at one stitch before our raglan increase, we're going to lift this stitch in between our stitches. Actually lift this bar, sorry, lift this bar in between our stitches and we're going to load it to the front of the work like we would if we were knitting, but we're gonna purl this stitch. So we're gonna purl this. So now we have made one right and we're gonna purl the next stitch. Slip our marker, purl the next stitch, and then we're going to make one left. So again, we're looking for that bar in between our stitches, which is right here. You can see it there. And we're going to load it to the back of the needle, like that. And then we're going to purl through the back. I know this is this part of it is kind of difficult and it's finicky, so just give yourself some grace. So we're going to purl through the back of the stitch. And sometimes it splits. There we go. So we've got our, I'll do that again. So we've loaded it to the back. So it looks like that. And we're going to take our knitting needle and load it to the back like this, like that. Hope that's focusing. And then we're going to purl that stitch like that. And there we've made one left. So we're gonna purl up to the next marker, one stitch before the marker, and I'll show you that one too. Hold on, I'm just gonna adjust the camera a little bit. All right, so we're going to purl up to that one stitch before our marker. And I purl using the Norwegian method, so it might look a little bit weird. If you're curious about how to knit the Norwegian way, I have a tutorial video for that as well. All right, so we're going to make one right. So again, we're looking for this, this bar in between our stitches, and we're gonna load it to the front of the needle. So I'm gonna pick it up, load it to the front of the needle like that. And then we're just gonna purl it as if to purl normal. Pull that off, purl one more, slip the marker, purl another stitch, because remember this is a wide make one right, make one left, okay? And now we're looking for that bar again. We're gonna find that bar and load it to the back of the work. So we're loading it to the back. See, we loaded it to the front last time, like that, right? But we're going to load it to the back of the needle like that okay and then you're going to hopefully i can show you so you're going to take your needle and you're going to slide it into that stitch like that and then you're going to bring your yarn through to purl it and slip it off so you've made one left and now we're just going to purl to the end because that's all of the increases that we need to do we already did the two we are, I already finished the two at the beginning, but I did wanna sh quickly show you what that looks like um, on the pearl side, so.